Okay, so welcome to the inside of the RV. This is the galley and living area. Uh, you have your driver and passenger seats over there, which I'll get into the details of those in a minute. But right now I wanna show you the sofa where we spend most of the time lounging and in the galley where we eat and prepare meals. This is the sofa, which also converts into a bed. You've got cabinets on top for some storage. Then you have your kitchen area, which is very, very convenient to have on the road. Cabinets, full sink, double-sided sink. You've got your nice Corian countertops. And then cabinets below, drawers for storage. Your oven, which is very nice and spacious. You can take a look inside there. Um, and then drawers for your cooking sheet. And then a full microwave, over-the-range microwave. This banquette also uh, converts into a bed and you also have the storage above it. Now I'm going to show you what it's like when I open this area up and uh, you'll see how spacious it gets. They can watch what they want or they can watch uh, television and then also each one comes with their own window and shades that they can open I can't reach that far without climbing up with the baby but each one has their own window with shades they can open and nice shelving back there to hold the books and my girls stuff stuffed animals everywhere and just made it really cozy like home and there's a lot of accessories Gabby's pillow, I don't know why it's there. And I also have an extra pillow, uh, my, my dirt, really dirty, scrubby unicorn, and my uh, my special toy, and Lego movie. And this is gonna push out, and I'll show you what that's like when this is opened up. Across from the girls' bunks, you have a half bath. So when I push this out, I'm gonna show you the half bath with the bunks and show you how spacious it gets here as well. Okay, so now I have all the slides on the RV pulled out. Let me show you how spacious it is with everything pulled out. And this is the maximum amount of space that we have during a, uh, while you're camping. This is the half bath. I'm gonna open the door and you can see you can swing up pretty large. I'll leave it open here and just swing it there.
You have a lot of space between the half bath and the bunks. And this door shuts for privacy. The bunks can be behind closed doors at night or any time during the day when you want to have the kids nap. And then you have your master bedroom. This is a lot of space, as you can see here, between your cabinets and drawers to the bed. And then you have your bathroom, your master bathroom. Nice big shower. I was able to take a shower with the baby in there, so it's a lot of space. And then you have a sink, toilet, cabinetry, a lot of storage, a lot of space. And then this bed also um, has storage under it for, for those of you who might need some additional space. Uh, here would be your like wardrobe area where you can put pillows and things like that. And then you have more drawer space. So as you can see, there's so much space to use while you travel. It's amazing what an RV can hold. Um, everything that you need for your family, I think. 